Hi, I'm Scott Carpenter with SCOCAR Marketing and PR. I'm here today with Nelson Gill of ACC Performance in Muscle Shoals, Alabama. And Nelson, I would like for you to give me the lowdown, if you will, on how to pick a stall and advertise stall ranges. Okay, well I'm going to answer that kind of backwards here. The advertised stalls that we have with our catalogs and how they're set up is based off of an A specific vehicle setup. This is based off of a 3450 pound car that uh, like a G body that um, basically has headers back to a white pipe still stock like and stock differential. So you have free to you've taken some of the back pressure off the motor but this is not a modified engine. The more you modify the engine the more stall you may need. So this gets very important to where you need to actually go through the entire build of the engine. You also have to calculate that versus the ability to move the weight of the vehicle. So obviously you need to know the weight of the vehicle. So with, with this calculation, this can kind of tell us you know, where your torque curve is going to be coming in. And, and that tells us on you know, what kind of a stall speed to actually pick for your particular application. But there's one thing that matters the absolute most. How do you want to drive your car?